If your studio wants to create dynamic gameplay on moving platforms without using complex scripts, temporary workarounds, or resource-heavy mesh regeneration, then keep watching because I'm about to show you how using the new feature from Kythera AI. Traditionally, nav meshes have always been static. So if you move the platform, the nav mesh is left behind and must constantly regenerate to keep up and stay functional. You don't have to look far to find forums and online communities filled with frustrated developers who've resorted to hacks or workarounds to try to solve this problem. Well, Kythera AI just released an out-of-the-box solution that's accessible for developers and doesn't use up expensive processing resources on constant regeneration. So let's dive into the Kythera Cove showcase and see how the moving nav mesh feature works. Here, the pink area indicates the nav mesh being used by the NPCs aboard the ship. As you can see, the nav mesh is moving with the ship without requiring any regeneration. When it comes time for the ship to dock on land, NPCs can move back and forth between the ship and shore with no special handling and without expensively regenerating large areas. Watch as the gangplank is extended to the dock, connecting the stationary nav mesh, shown here in green, to the moving nav mesh, shown in pink, only automatically regenerating the small area necessary to create a unified nav mesh. Once your agents have boarded and it's time to weigh anchor, the moving nav mesh unlinks, letting your agents continue on their journey. One of the most exciting things about this feature is that it works in tandem with Kythera AI's existing capabilities, including automatic cover markup, automatic navigation links for jumps and climbs, and even dynamic changes to the nav mesh. Watch as the moving nav mesh dynamically responds to changes, like the destruction of the mast as the ships engage each other. Let's slow that down so you can see it in action. You can see the nav mesh regenerate in response to the fallen mast, indicated by the changing colors, with the regenerated nav mesh now excluding the area blocked by the mast. Designers can choose to have the regeneration scripted based on an event, or let Kythera AI detect physics changes and automatically regenerate the nav mesh for them. So, not only can moving nav mesh be unified with static navigation mesh, but it can also regenerate while in motion. Cover rails can be generated with Kythera AI automatic cover markup. By dynamically analyzing the geometry of your level at runtime, any set pieces within your game can instantly become a cover point for enemies to hide behind or an obstacle to vault over. These combat sequences are not scripted. The NPCs select the most appropriate points on the cover rails to engage the enemy actors using Kythera AI's spatial query system to evaluate the available positions, which change and update dynamically as the battle unfolds. Keep your eye on the NPC on the left. The debug draw shows the cover locations as cylindrical spotlights, with different colors indicating the value of the various options available to the agents, red indicating a poor choice, and green highlighting the best option for the active agent. As the spatial query system evaluates and updates positioning in real time, the NPC moves between the cover points identified for it, creating an engaging battle scene. Kythera AI Moving Navigation Mesh untethers the nav mesh and provides a transformative shift in how we approach movable platforms in game creation. Unlike the typical approaches to moving platforms, with moving nav mesh, it's not necessary to constantly regenerate the navigation mesh, nor does it require tricks of perspective. Where other approaches significantly undercut performance, our feature boasts high efficiency. All that's required is to keep the coordinate system in sync with the frame of reference of the actor it's linked to achieved by updating a 4x4 matrix once per frame. The feature is easy to set up, compatible with major engines, developer and designer friendly, and can be introduced into a game at any stage of development. Game developers are no longer bound by the limitations of stationary navigation meshes, opening up new realms of creativity and innovation, and widening the possibilities for advanced gameplay and navigation. Studios can now explore game design options that were previously out of reach with this powerful generic solution to an industry-wide problem. Head to kythera.ai to find out more.